If you are new here, be sure to subscribe because we are on the road to 150 subs and I make NBA content just like this every single day. So th there's your reason right there. All right, welcome back to another Cedric Lewis My Career. And you're probably wondering, hey, weren't you on the Heat last episode? Yes, I was. And I did get traded to form a super team in New Orleans. Now, what would have been lit is if you can add a custom roster, because I would have put Zion on the team. Because small forward is the only position we kind of need. But we have a pretty good super team here. With me, Anthony Davis, and Drew Holiday, all averaging over 20 points a game. This team's going to be nasty. It's going to be real nasty. We are going up against the Philadelphia 76ers. And I am playing on all-star difficulty instead of superstar. I do need to get used to NBA Live because I was playing a lot of 2K. So I'm going to be playing on all-star. I will be back on superstar very soon. All right. NBA on ESPN. Pelicans Sixers. Sixers are 3-0. And we're at one and two. I just joined the team. I was three and one with the Heat, but the the Sixers are probably the no. They they're the hardest team to face in this game because the cover athlete Joel Embiid is a monster. He hits like every shot. He's a monster in real life. And they got Jimmy Butler, d defense hits shot. JJ Redick hits almost every shot. It's insane. All right, we're starting off this game pulling up and getting a foul. Legit, just started off this game and I'm getting fouled already. That's okay, that's that's a decent way to start. That's a pretty decent way to start this um Pelicans my career, I guess. And obviously I'm gonna hit hit these. Let's see if I can hit this next one. I'm looking to hit off oh, that's not a good release, but it still goes in. I'm just gonna say right now, I had over fifteen free throws in this game. I'm not gonna tell you how many I made. But from that, I think you can tell I made a very good amount. As Drew Holiday's pulling up for the mid. I'm telling you, this is going to be a deadly trio right here. Deadly trio. I say trio, even first of all, NBA Live, how the hell does Drew Holiday miss that shot? And like, stuff like that is so annoying. As Joel Embiid is going to miss his layup. Like, seriously, how does those miss? How? These are professional athletes. As I'm going up and missing my layup. When I say trio, you may be wondering, oh, Julius Randle's on the team. Julius Randle's a beast. Yeah, in real life, in this game, he's not that good. And it's also very hard to feed Anthony Davis, Drew Holiday, and Julius Randle without just compromising my scoring as well because I want to score the ball, obviously. And I want to get everyone involved. I want to get my the second and third best players on the team involved as Anthony Davis is breaking the rim. <laughs> Holy hell. But yeah, like I said, I really want to get AD and um, Drew Holiday involved. Kind of like I do in 2K. I get my second and third best players involved trying to get them. Pretty pretty decent stats as I'm pulling up 4-3 to three and bricking it. I'm currently 9-9. to nine, But I'm going to pull up once again and I'm actually going to drill this one. I shot very poorly from 3 of this game. And in the first half, I shot poorly overall. I think I shot 5-14 for 14 in the first half. Which was not good, but Drew Holiday, once again, knocking down another shot. He's two for six. He would go on to make to go two for four to end the first half. As I'm going, throwing up the layup, I got 11 points. I have two for five. Once again, not very good shooting, but Drew Holiday gets a steal, and I'm throwing up the floater, getting to go, making it an 11-point game. 11-2 run. I come back in the game in the second quarter. I'm putting up a terrible shot, but Anthony Davis is there to clean it up. Currently up by 8 points. And we are we are taking care of the Sixers team. They are going to bring it close as I get the Euro step in the paint on Ben Simmons. 4 for 9. I have 11 free throws already. 11 in the first half as AD gets the hook shot on Boban. AD's having a good game. He's got 10 points already. As Stanley Johnson is going to get involved throwing up the layup. Over Joel Embiid. That, that's impressive. We're only up by four now, though. Like I said, the Sixers are starting to get back into this game. But Anthony Davis with the rejection. I can't speak English. Anthony Davis. Then he goes and misses the layup. Live EA. What are you doing? But then we get the steal, and I'm in the paint, getting the layup to go. And one. Two minutes left in the second. We're up by three. Going up by four because you already know I'm making the free throw. 
currently up by four as the second quarter is about to end. We can't get the last shot off. We don't have enough time as Drew Holiday shoots it. Up by four, going into the half. That's pretty damn good. Actually, pretty damn good is, and calm down. I have 25 points, and I've only made five shots. One three-pointer. Unbelievable. Joel Embiid has 23. He's 11 for 18. It's like, wow. We almost has half their points. But I did get player of the half despite shooting 5 for 14 in the first half. I did have 25 points. But, dude, I, I shot terrible. But the second half, I was alive as Drew Holiday once again knocking down the 3. He's 2 for 4 from 3-point land. 5 for 11 in the game. As Anthony Davis going in the paint, throwing up the layup. 9-point game. And that, it was, it got out of hand in the third quarter. We just started chucking up shots, making them. Here, I was mad because I couldn't hit any threes. If it wasn't green, it wasn't going in. It was very annoying. But this quarter, I went 6 for 6 to end the game. These last three minutes, I went 6 for 6. So you can see I'm 10 for 27. I made 6 of my shots. I think 2 or 3s, and the rest were all 2-pointers. As I'm in the lane, throwing up the layup. Six for six to get my stats, my shooting percentage almost. I think I had 48% from the field. Before this, I was at like 35. I went, like I said, I shot like four for 16 from three, so there was no hope in getting that up. But as you can see, I'm giving it to Czech Diallo, who's throwing up the layup. He's got five points in this game. We're up by 20. Yeah, see, this is why I don't like All Star, because stuff like this, we just blow out teams. And I once again make my second shot. I'm um, 15 for 15 from the free throw line. Kick it back to me. I'm was gonna pull up, but I realized that's not a smart shot. At this point, I already know we won the game, so I want to get my stat shooting stats better. I don't want to be shooting some 30 something percent. And I'm getting the green on the moving shot three. I have was that 19 points in the second half. 19 as I get right there 46 points in the game. I'm looking for 50. I'm looking for 50. I'm about to go 5, 4, 5. That's it. Eight seconds left. You would think it's over at this point. No. J.J. Eric gets fouled on a three. I got, I got a couple seconds. I got a second left. Pulling up for the shot clock. Jeez. Getting 51 points. Shooting 16 for 33. After starting the first half with 5 for 14. In Santity. I uh, went 11 for 19 to end the game. Anthony Davis had 20, and Drew had 19. And J.J., Ben, and Joel did really good. Joel only took one shot in the second half and missed it. But I was player of the game, obviously. I had 15 assists, 6 rebounds, also 3 steals. And Tobias Harris was cold as hell. 0 for 7. So if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like. Subscribe if you are new, because I make NBA content every single day. And that's it for me. GG.